In this video, we are going to discuss a very simple basic Java program in which we will see how we can get inputs from the user in the form of int and then at the output we will print those inputs and some of those inputs as well using a scanner class. Here I am sort of, I make tech related videos on this channel every single week. If you are new to my channel and may be interested in tech videos then consider subscribing to this channel. So here you can see I am using notepad++. You can use any of your favorite IDE of your choice like Eclipse, NetBeans etc. Let's code. Now here first create the main class like public class user input. Inside it create the main method public static void main string args. Inside it, let import the scanner class first from the util package. So to import the scanner class, we must have to add this line of code which is import java.util.scanner. I already made a video on a scanner class and its importance in details. If you want to know more about it, then check i tab and description of this video where you can find the link of that video. So basically why we use a scanner class? The answer is to get input from the user. So now after importing the package we use the scanner class like scanner sc is equals to new scanner and inside the bracket pass system.in and here now let we want to print something like we are going to tell the user to enter the first number so just code like system dot out dot println enter first number and here call the object of the scanner class so that the user can input the value int number one is equals to sc dot next int Here number 1 is basically a variable which will store the first int value number which the user will enter. The same we are going to get the second number from the user. So for that system.out.println enter second number and then int number 2 is equals to sc.nextint. Similarly here number 2 is a variable which will store the second int value number which the user will enter. Now here I am going to add one more print statement which is system.out.println your entered number is. It will basically look good when we print the user inputs at the output. So now let's add the print statement for the user input. So for that we code like system.out.println inside the bracket number one and number two this will basically print both user input int numbers let's save the program and run it so here we can see it runs successfully it first asked to enter the first number let enter 25 now it asked to enter the second number let enter 55 after pressing enter we can see it's showing both user inputs right with the additional statement which we were added which is your entered number is now let us add both of these numbers and print to show at the output so for that here create a variable say int sum to store the sum of both the int values like int sum is equals to number one plus number two and finally to print the sum just run the print statement system.out.println and inside the bracket just pass the sum is and the sum like plus sum let's save it and run it now you can see here it asks to enter the first number let enter 1 2 3 and press enter again it asks to enter the second number let enter anything like 4 5 6 and press enter you can see here it's showing both the numbers first which user entered and below it 
it's showing the sum of both the numbers which is 579 this is how we can use a scanner class to get inputs from users in java so friends if you find this video helpful then don't forget to like this video subscribe to our channel and to get notification of our more tech videos press the bell icon